up next. Fresh, juicy, tasty. Would you believe it's a whole boneless chicken with a twist of various flavors? Wow! A must-try recipe of Rojo, oven-baked boneless chicken. I'm Rodney Ilagan. I'm president of Rojo Yam Foods Corporation. Currently, I'm the general manager of uh, Rojo Oven Baked Boneless Chicken. We called our restaurant Rojo because it was derived from my name and my wife's name, being Rodney and Joanne. Some would say it as uh, Rojo, which means uh, red in Spanish, but uh, we'd like to make it sound better by saying Rojo. I was working with Ali Bin Ali Medical as a project manager, and uh, I, I was there for about 12 years, and I was thinking of uh, going back home to settle for good. So I was thinking what kind of business I could put up. So I thought of uh, putting up a restaurant business. And uh, something that has chicken or pork, because you know, Filipinos are, you know, they love chicken and pork. And then I said, it has to be uh, different, but uh, how different? One good thing is offering a boneless chicken. So I started uh, developing the process of how to debone a whole boneless chicken. And then finally, I have an oven bake and a whole boneless chicken. And what flavors? So I came up with the three flavors we that we have now, the Asian barbecue, Mediterranean barbecue, and the Caribbean roast. We wanted to introduce the Caribbean roast because it's one of the flavors I've tasted uh, in, in one of my trips. And uh, I fell in love with it. And uh, I tried to research and uh, m make our own take of uh, Caribbean roast. Mediterranean barbecue, this is uh, one of my favorites when I was still uh, living in Doha, Qatar. We also want to offer the Asian barbecue chicken so that those less adventurous could go for the safe uh, chicken barbecue. Taste is something that gives you great pleasure and when, when you taste something really good, you want to go back and have more of it. We prepare our chicken in the commissary where the, the staff do the deboning and the marinating. We freeze it and deliver it to the store. And in the store, we baste it again and we put it on a tray and uh, oven bake it for one hour and 20 minutes. In between, we turn the chicken and baste it again so we, we have more flavor. When we serve the chicken to the customer, they would say, wow, it's really boneless. And when they taste it, they, they really like it because, you know, it, it's, it's something different. The flavor and the taste and the juiciness. The, the reason why we chose to bake, oven bake our chicken is because it is more healthier to oven bake a chicken wherein you'll see all the fats coming out. We, again, we want to be different from the others. Uh, here at Rojo, we have a motto. You are not just our customer, you are our special guest. And we try to make our store really clean so that they will have a very nice place to eat at. I think entrepreneurship is in my blood already. 18, 19 years old, I, I would uh, engage in uh, some sort of business. I've learned so many things uh, in putting up businesses. Uh, one of them is do not expect that you'll have a growing business in your first shot. It takes a lot of uh, research and time and courage and learning and luck to be able to have a real good business. And of course, prayer and asking the Lord uh, which business would really be for you. I think cooking or baking is very special. So when, when I want to make a recipe, I try to get as much recipes as much as I could and get the best ingredients and make it my own. I want to make sure it's tasty enough. So even, even if I cook it or try it many times, it's okay. Just to end up with the best uh, tasting product or food. And to add to that, I think you have to put love in, in everything you do. Like, I, love, I really love to cook, and I love to cook with my wife. So we, we take care of 
producing or making real good chickens. I'm Rodney Ilagan, proud to be in Trapinoy. Proud to be in Trapinoy.